My name is Kunal Fabiani. I'm the CEO of Americas in Africa, located in uh, Dubai. Qatar's vision 2030 as well is an ambitious uh, national vision uh, aiming to transform Qatar into um, an advanced society capable of sustainable de development. We all know that recently um, the FIFA World Cup was held right uh, last year, recently. I say recently, but it was a year ago, right? Um, that, uh, that put Qatar basically in the center of the world, right? Uh, and, and a lot of eyes uh, and investment went into Qatar. There's still been a lot of interest in, in companies and businesses that uh, are now familiar with Qatar and have seen it that it's a, it presents a, a friendly business environment, right? Uh, Qatar is also emphasized in diversifying the economy from uh, oil and gas dependency. And it actively promotes uh, sectors like uh, tourism, sports, uh, and education, right? Uh, there's a robust financial sector. Uh, the Qatar Financial Center is, is an example of, of a platform for businesses to access a uh, uh, broader Middle East market, right? And uh, lastly, to mention the several tax treaties that the, countries has, the country has globally to prevent double tax treaties, further, further boosting investor confidence. It's important that you mention challenges. It's it's not always been easy to, to, as a foreign investor to set up in the UAE or Qatar or Saudi. Uh, it has become it has become easier. Um, and uh, I want to say that uh, Healy Consultants established itself in 2017. It established its presence in, in the UAE uh, because there was a vision uh, that these markets, not only Saudi, Qatar, UAE, but also uh, you know, Bahrain, Kuwait, Oman, right? These were GCC in, in general is, is, is a, our markets that uh, uh, will attract a lot of attention and uh, interest from foreign direct uh, investments. So coming to the UAE, establishing our, our presence in, in the country was, uh, was important uh, to establish uh, the legitimacy of, of our business. Uh, so we can help clients uh, overcome those challenges, make it a smooth process to, to set up businesses, to get licensed, to open bank accounts, right? And just for the clients to, to concentrate or to focus on evolving their business and developing their business and not to worry about the whole legal and tax, tax aspect, right? That's, that's where we come in. So we were essentially we essentially become the bridge uh, for these investors to establish themselves in, in the country. Uh, definitely the div diversification from, from oil dependency, that's number one. Uh, so creating that awareness through videos like these um, and through content that we put on our website uh, showing opportunities in different different sectors, right? Um, uh, showcasing that these countries have a capability to to welcome businesses in all different sectors, which are not related to um, the oil and gas industry, right? That's number one. Um, and the second is the technological uh, advancement um, and innovation, right? The push for technological advancement and innovation of all of these countries, um, such as you know, e-commerce, blockchain uh, projects, technological projects, e-commerce. Uh, I mentioned that before. So the push for uh, fintech capability in, in all of these countries, attracting foreign talent, foreign investment uh, in in all these um, locations, is, is just a just a sign of of investor confidence um, and that the countries are. These countries are ready to, to welcome these types of these types of businesses. If you have any inquiries, if you want to know how we can help you and your businesses um, set up in 
any of these regions, uh, please email us at email at healyconsultants.com or contact us via any of the social media channels that you'll find in the links below. Thank you.